All right, here we go. Me recording practice. <laughs> Okay, so I'm Little Blue Beluga. And I just wanted to kind of incorporate kind of practicing and like recording, I guess. I'm kind of in this like lull period with my album where like I recorded a bunch of stuff and I'm listening to it and I just don't feel confident in it right now. And it's making me anxious, so I'm going to just try to practice things that are just like the way they are, just so I can kind of connect better to the pieces. I'm also really missing my bass. I handed it in to get set up, and it takes like two weeks because they're kind of behind, and it's like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like missing it already. Um which is kind of funny. It's like two days. I had, ah, mm, maybe it's not, ah, mm, Wednesday, Tuesday, maybe I handed it in. Okay, anyways. So this is me practicing perhaps what a show with me would be like. So I'm always going to bring a tarot deck because I just want it to be like, I always want to set like I think an intention for the show is just kind of like, um, I want it to be like positive, I guess it doesn't necessarily, maybe it's too much expectation, but you know, I want it to be a place where like people come, like hang out, <laughs> enjoy my presence, but also hopefully like maybe get something out of it in a sense of like, maybe they're inspired to like also do what they want to do. Cause I think that's why I'm doing what I'm doing is because I felt like I couldn't do this. And it's also, also, but also why I do this is like, I feel like there's this just feeling inside of me that like I have to do it. And it's not like, it doesn't feel bad. Like it feels good. Like I feel like this is, okay, yeah. Moosages, I've got three cards here, but basically, um, yeah, I wanna, I know I'm, okay. I think normally I'll probably max out, I guess this is just me talking out loud. So, this is for my own reference, and I might put this up just so people can see my process. But I imagine, um, yeah, I'll be playing in intimate settings <laughs> just because we're starting out. It'll be kind of cute. And um, I'll always have like a, a kind of like a deck, a deck segment. And um, I recently bought this new Oracle deck. It's called Earthcraft. There's 44 cards. Um, and then maybe I'll be like, I'll ask the audience if they have any questions and then we'll try to like channel that to see if we could give a collective message, but of course it might not be for everyone, but maybe it will be I've got three cards. I think like three is a lot. I think I should only do one. So we're going to reshuffle and do one, but the ones that came up here is run with wolves, light and accept your gifts. Ah, oh, fuck it, it came out. I guess I have to read that. Okay, here we go. It's going to be like a long intro, but, you know. <sighs> they came out, they came out. Okay, so we've got two. Can't really see this, and then I have to like, ew. So we got two. Uh, it's very pretty. It's very pretty. Accept your gifts. That was kind of funny. I was like, oh yeah, I just don't think I just have to do. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. So, duh. Your unique gifts are what make you who you are, and they are the most natural path to finding your purpose. For some, gifts may come in forms of a green thumb or an innate ability to heal animals. For others, their gifts might be compassion, strong intuition, and a natural open heart. Gifts are variety as the billions of people who live on this earth, and no two gifts are exactly the same. Lovely. It is common to receive this card when you are downing yourself and your natural talents. A part of us always knows what we're good at. We receive little moments of clarity when doing something that sparks curiosity, joy, familiarity, and excitement. 
Accepting your natural gifts is like the sun rising on a new day. It brings light and clarity after a period of darkness or a sense of feeling lost. Using your gifts will feel natural, as though you can't imagine how life would be without it. Doubting your gifts drains your power. If you're feeling unmotivated, lacking in energy, or confused, it is likely because you must learn to trust yourself again. Believe in your ability to know what feels right in your soul. Accept your gifts. They will bring light to the path of confidence, joy, and fulfillment. Well, that's pretty and beautiful. Okay. Affirmation. So also this deck, it will like give an explanation of what like this card is. And then usually I like to like look at the card and kind of see what else it kind of like comes to mind. Um, so there's like a butterfly on this, which is for me always kind of symbolizes transition. But for me, it also symbolizes like kind of like a little high from um, like people that may not be in my life right now. <laughs> because they're dead um <laughs> and they've passed on but I feel like a butterfly is this just nice little like gentle like hug from like you know if you believe in this kind of stuff like you have like your angels and your ancestors and like kind of your spirit guides and it and it also is like a profound like transformation obviously you know butterfly it's like you know the story caterpillar butterfly therefore transformation I don't need to say anything more than that um it looks like this person i don't know how they identify is looking that way so to me it's the right um but like they're also touching their whatever chakra this is i don't know all of them but like i guess their third eye which is also like from my understanding is like also forward thinking they're also holding this like crystal ball. So that's exciting. That's also very future forward too. Um, and there's like this squiggly path thing that also comes out of the ball actually. Wow, this is crazy. And it's very vibrant colors. So very future -y. Okay, so then the little activity it does is accept your gifts affirmation. Affirmations can help you create new perspectives and positive healthy thoughts about yourself look <laughs> oh yeah it always had these mirror stuff and like i'm always very like um i'm delicate with mirrors <laughs> i don't know if anyone says that but like um i'm not really that superstitious but i think like um you know i look at myself in the mirror just to like you know check my appearance but i like don't look at myself i don't know if people like look at yourself i think sometimes you're like looking at your outside but this little book um, is always kind of like when you look in the mirror, you like look into your soul. And I was like, oh, it's kind of weird because it's a mirror. So it's not really, um, it's like a reflection of how you see yourself, but isn't going to be how other people see you because that's not like people, that's like not how it works. Isn't that so weird? I'm not going to finish that thought. I haven't fully thought of formation. Anyways, okay. The affirmation can help you create blah, 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 blah. Look in the mirror, it says. As you say these words, place your right hand on the surface of the mirror. Oops, sorry. Your left hand on your forehead. Oh, now I can't read. Okay. <laughs> Just some visualizations for my more visual learners. Okay. So uh, left hand on your forehead to stream energy. Okay. From the reflection to yourself and say the affirmations out loud. Repeat them once in the morning and then again before bed. Okay, so we can do this together. Just bring your phone there. I am on purpose for a purpose. Oh, sorry. I am on a <laughs> I am on a purpose for a purpose on my sacred journey here on earth. It's funny how you can read something and maybe change the meaning of something. Anyways, I hold all the tools I need to walk my path. Yeah, you do. We always have everything we need. Love that energy. I look within to find answers to my questions because all I need to know is within me. Ooh, yeah, you got this. Okay. I am capable, worthy, and deserving of the knowledgement that I am sacred, gifted, and magical. Yes, you are. So that's beautiful. Next, we have 16 Light. I am light, I am light. I don't know if you guys know that song. It's pretty nice. I should, I should probably quote songs if I know songs, but I don't always know artist's name, but she, sh I should know her name because she's a 
she wrote another song and she put her name in a song and i was like that's boss like that's so boss just puts her puts their full name in a chorus india avi yeah she has a song called like she's she's really cool okay light ready the source oh sorry <laughs> i'm like jumping ahead the sun is the source of all life on earth without the sun plants could not grow and humans would cease to exist in the same way you have a sun radiating from within your heart living your life through your heart means acting on your passion speaking your truths and being your authentic self no matter the people or circumstances surrounding you every time you compare yourself to someone else diminishes yourself or ign ignores your needs to please others a cloud forms around your heart and obscuring its pure life giving energy your dreams and desires are waiting patiently behind dark clouds that are preventing your heart from spreading light throughout your soul do not look to others to tell you who you should be only you can manifest the future you desire your heart will shine its guiding light outward sending nourishment to the people things and opportunities that will help you shine wealth loving relationships health and fulfilling fulfilling jobs will all be yours your light is a beacon of all your hopes and dreams drawing them in to you oh, another meditation guide okay so the guided light meditation read through the steps first before attempting this practice okay so no visual aids until i've i've read it first this is what the instructions say <laughs> find, find a place where you can sit or stand quietly i like the options close your eyes and calm your mind and body envision yourself standing in an open field surrounded by sunflowers it's a dark, cool, and quiet. It's the moment right before the sun rises. Your toes are digging into the dirt. The wind is kissing your skin, and you are ready to welcome the light. Naturally. Lift your chin up as the sun edges over the horizon. Stand taller, stronger, more confident. Or sit. It also said you could sit. Feel the sun lift you up and fill, fill you with light. Now take your senses in the field of flowers around you. What are they doing? What are they feeling? Yes, they are moving just as you are, lifting high and turning their blooms to embrace the sun the very same way. Allow that feeling of openness with the flowers to run through your bones and ignite your heart. Beam with your inner light, which streams from your chest for miles. That's pretty self-explanatory, I think. I think that's like kind of a nice combination with with accepting your gifts. Because um, I think it still echoes the, you know, you got this. You got this. You know, don't think too much about what other people are doing. Just focus on doing what you have because that's beautiful and purposeful. Uh, one and six is seven. Seven plus two is nine. If we're going to add all the numbers together, two plus four is six. Six and nine is 15. 15 is six. And then, then we have six, six, three. Okay. The last card is 24. Oh yeah, I guess I didn't show you the light card. She's literally just bathing in, or sorry, they are just bathing in sunlight. Um, also this person that is also not gendered is, well, I don't know. So I just, I will just speak that they are, I will just assume they are both, um, cause we are both feminine and masculine. Okay. So 24 run with wolves. This one's kind of fun. looks like it's ocean. This person's just like looking at the ocean. And then perhaps it's the moon. I think it's the moon. The moon, it's almost like, you know what? This almost looks like an eclipse. It is eclipse season coming up. I think our first, I think it's a lunar or solar eclipse. You know, there's only two eclipses, right? It's either lunar or <laughs> solar. Who, who is in front, you know? Anyways, but <laughs> April 30th, I think is the new moon and that's gonna be an eclipse though. So I think it's a lunar eclipse look it up i'm not like an eclipse thing but the generality of eclipses is 
brand new beginnings, transformation, things that happen completely out of your control. It's a good time to just like really sit with everything that's happening and just kind of like, this is when forces outside of yourself, just like, it's like a whoosh. I love the way I describe things. I know. I don't know if it makes any sense, but okay. So run with wolves, run with wolves. I think of wolves. I think of that Shakira song. You know, he's a she wolf in the closet. Oh, love Shakira. Okay. From the snowy peaks and the midnight forests and across the vast distances. Wolves howled not just to the moon spirit, but to communicate their location and issue warnings. Who knew? Um, wolves are fierce, loyal packed animals who are excellent at managing relationships that serve the greater good. We love a good community member. We love good community members. Okay. Their packs function in a similar way to many human families they rely on one another for food safety shelter knowing instinctively that there is strength in numbers in each other uh-huh. Ooh, into another. Uh-huh. that's what came to my mind okay however as the human fam however as in human families it is not uncommon for the one lo- one wolf, the one loaf, the one wolf to be aggressive towards another in the pack or to separate from the group for a while. It happens. We all need alone time. I get it. Some people are annoying. Occasionally, a wolf feels the need to seek a new pack and a new place to call home in order to thrive. Mm. Run with wolves commonly comes to you when you are questioning your relationships and interactions with others. Hee <laughs> hee. As you become more aware of your emotional needs. Girl, we've been aware of our emotional needs forever. But yes, <laughs> for those of you, for those of you, I think I was gifted with a lot of emotions. So like um, you can only go so far, you know, if you're like an emotional person. You can only go so far without fucking dealing with your emotions because you could succumb to your emotions and die. <laughs> and then it's, you know, it's the next lifetime's problem. But anyways, so <laughs> I don't know where that came from. Uh, as you become more aware of your emotional needs, you might find that familiar relationships, even those with family, no longer align with your soul. Mm, happens. Additionally, this card could mean you have lost pieces of yourself and what is important to you, Prize, prioritizing the desire of others over your own. Mm, it happens. It may be time to consider whether or not you're, you've been running with the wrong pact. Ooh, wrong pack. Could it be time to strike out on your own into the wild wilderness to find something better? It also... It could also mean that you must find your voice and loving create better boundaries in your relationship. Boundaries are important. I think, and I think this is something like I've been talking a lot about, but I don't know if it's something I'm like, yeah, who, yeah, I think something that I've been thinking a lot about too is, um, like I'm a, for me, it's like very easy to just like, go in alone and be like super efficient and independent and it can be hard sometimes to um when you I think when you go through a period of that like again go out and like meet new friends or reconnect with your friends um and I think that's discomfort is okay like I think there's something to be said that they're like relationships are meant to be discomforting and usually you can learn from that obviously like if there's like abuse of any kind or someone is like not well intentioned like and your gut's like no don't do this like definitely like you know sever that relationship um but I think it's like a balance like I think we need people like I think we're community based and I think nature works together all the time they all like coexist beautifully and they grow beautifully together and they find the balance so I think if you're a person that's kind of feeling like you know it's always good to evaluate relationships too I think because as you grow sometimes you do kind of outgrow people I've definitely done that 
Um, sometimes it's painful to let go of people. Um, but don't dwell on history, right? Like, um, the more you give kind of that kind of space, they can also find people that kind of match their energy better too. But when you go off, make sure you also take time for obviously loving yourself and protecting yourself, but, you know, being open to friends that may crumb, come across your path. Okay. <laughs> Are we going to be surprised at the practice for this one? Howl to the moon, awakening practice. Love this. I was literally thinking about this. I've been thinking about like hallowing, hallowing at the moon lately. I don't know why. Like I, it's something that I've, I've done like a couple years ago and I was like, oh, this is really nice. And then I've got like busy and then I stopped doing it. Also kind of weird when you do it alone. Okay. So <laughs> in this powerful practice, I just innately feel like a dog, like all the time. Anyways, so, okay. You are <laughs> invited to howl at the moon spirit as the wolves do, opening your heart and the wild spirit to release what you're holding onto that no longer serves you. Oh, it's one of those. Okay. It also clears the noise from the mind so that you can better receive guidance of any issue or situation. I'm a big fan of like yelling and having like tantrums, but like, like, you know, just be like, I'm a tantrum. And you're just like, ah. <laughs> and it can be however you want but like yo it's like releases tension you know also working out is important like get a sweat going whatever that means to you stand tall take a breath take a deep breath and as you exhale from the mouth sigh with an exaggerated ah sound but also be careful because like a lot of this like breathing out techniques i've learned is not actually good for your vocals so if you're a singer like also be careful with your vocals it can handle some yelling but like you know treat it nice like deep s has like uh. like that's like hard on your vocal cords um do this five times and on the sixth time instead of ah uh, howl repeat two more times let loose more freely in the flow with your energy be wild howl from the deep inside of you i mean just howl like you can breathe breathing is great but just howl okay <laughs> music i <laughs> know okay <laughs> That's my little like musical intro from Little Boo Beluga. And we're gonna start with this one. Cause I'm still, I don't, this is like how I wrote the song, but I actually kind of like this song better on the bass, but this is, I guess the original template. need to practice saying songs before I sing them. This is helpfulness. You're gonna kill me with your helpfulness. All I need from you is to sit right here. Oh, I don't need to be led by your power. All you're trying to do is help yourself. Don't stare at me my mind i missed a line can't read my mind actually i think i need to work this out okay there you go you're gonna kill me with your helpfulness all i need from you is to sit right here oh i don't need to be led by your power 
are you trying to do sell me aid no i'm not in the market to be saved oh the responsibility that you feel for me nothing helpful can be done if we can't sit and listen to what they have said you're trying to do is help yourself don't stare at me you can't read my mind you can't read my mind you can't read my mind so don't tell me please please don't kill me with your helpfulness all I need is someone here Please don't kill me, kill me with your helpfulness. Please stop, kill me. So this is where we started. You're the hero, but I wondered if you ever heard a word that I said. I told you I don't want your guidance you persist could you just sit and listen no you can't read my mind so don't tell me how to feel or what to do please don't kill me with your helpfulness all I need is someone here your words please don't kill me kill me with your helpfulness please don't kill me cause every time I <laughs> I haven't figured this part out yet. Every time I look, because I've changed it so many times. Every time I look around, I cannot find somewhere to go. Because nothing seems to, nothing seems to, nothing seems to, not to get through. Please, so please. Please don't kill me with your helpfulness or that is someone here. No, I don't want your words. Please don't kill me, kill me with your helpfulness. Please don't kill me. No, please don't kill me with your helpfulness. Please don't kill me with your helpfulness. Oh, it's so high. I should have warmed up more. I was like, ah. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Should we do the next vocally challenging song? Or should we just do a piano pace? <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. Okay, let's do some slaps, let's do some splits, splits. 
the Yeah, it was really funny. Yesterday I recorded stuff, but then the piano was not recording at all. It was just like, it was like click, 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 like just the tapping sound. And I was like, so this is literally just me doing vocals hearing, because I was hearing the piano through my interface, but um, I don't, I guess I don't know if it, it was actually like picking up audio from the interface or it was just using like the mic on the laptop. It was, it was, it was, it was kind of sad guys. But you know, it happens. It happens. It happens all the time. So I'm just turn that down. notes I want to get back to baseline I want to get back to where I was can I reach can I reach can I reach back 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 oh, oh no oh oh my no can I reach can I reach baseline Doesn't sound like this. Is this one or this? Yeah. Cause I can't fall in. I can't recognize myself. No, it goes back down. Recognize myself.
still working on that just like um playing that one on here we're gonna like work this is why we're practicing this is why we're practicing okay <laughs> Like, why is it? Because I set it. Sorry, the last song was Baseline, and this song, yeah, we'll just chit chat a little bit more. So, this next song that I'm gonna play, <laughs> uh, we need to stretch my forearm, it's getting tight. Okay, so, oh, this is good. Take breaks. Okay, so this next song that I'm gonna play is um, called The Lovely Ones. This song means a lot to me. I wrote it about this very important person in my life. Um, <clears throat> when I was born, supposedly, <laughs> this is what they tell me, um, they would sing to me, <laughs> they would sing, isn't she lovely, isn't she wonderful, like the Stevie, Stevie Wonder song, because it was like about a newborn baby girl, and like, I was a newborn baby girl at the time, like, wow, amazing, okay, so, <laughs> It's also how I feel. Um, it's also that. And um, it's also about kind of like my experience with working in kind of like mental health. Um, I think there needs to be more resources when it comes to mental health supports. I think there also needs to be more supports for people that work in mental health. Um, I also don't, and I know things are kind of changing in different ways, but I think in mental health, like people with mental health diagnoses, um, I've seen them. They just don't get treated the same, like especially when it comes to when they have like physical health things, because sometimes it's related back to, well, maybe this is just a symptom of like your mental health. And it's like, who cares? It's like all connected, like, duh. Like, you know, if I'm like physically unwell, I'm going to be more mentally unwell. And if I'm mentally unwell, I'm going to be physically unwell because I'm not taking care of myself. I was like, we should be beyond this. But um, yeah, so anyways, I wrote a song about that. <laughs> trust them if they don't trust you they only want to make you more like them so why can they trust you if they don't trust you yeah how does that make sense they only want to help but they'll never listen to you but you're the sweetest person soul I've ever found and you are absolutely lovely lovely to me and how do you know how I feel without my words how do you listen this way and I'll listen to you See things 
things that most can't perceive and you get overwhelmed but i don't blame you because how can you trust them if they don't trust you they only want to make you more like them so how can they trust you if they don't trust you yeah how does it make sense they only want to help but they'll never now because it's different because you piano I play this which is like what is that I don't know I should know but I'm like I have like a music theory test I really should this should be a good practice for myself but right now I just want to focus on playing okay I'm like fuck it whatever it is I don't have to call things things sometimes ah! okay <laughs> I'm like, ah! uh, that was an example of a mini tantrum very healthy very healthy. That was my song called The Lovely One. Okay, next song. I know. Am I ready to sing this? Some good warm ups. I haven't like actually played this song through in a while. love let's sing a different love song let's sing a cheesy pop love song <clears throat> that i wrote oh this is a very interesting tone to use it's very high here should we go with it sure oh, it's too chimey can't hear the lower end of this like this is like really overpowering so maybe we go with just a piano then
ever felt the way I feel for you. I have my dreams and I have my illusions too. But I still have hope for me and you. And how do you know when to let go? Every time I see you, I go blind and all I know is how I feel. And you feel like a dream to me. Like you feel like a dream. He, 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 you feel high. I know when I try to tell you how I felt, it didn't go as I planned, so I left it all. But I still feel all these things when I'm with you, and I still feel all these things, but I'll be alright. Every time I see you, I go blind and all I know is how I feel. And you feel like a dream to me. You feel like you feel like a dream. You feel I see you, I go blind and all I know is how I feel and you feel like a dream to me. You feel like you feel like a dream. I feel like when I sit for me to play this on piano and sing it is like hard because I'm trying to like really not go crazy. Like I feel like sometimes when I play that song, the way I play piano is like competing with like my vocals. So it's like, I'm like, you should accompany me. And then I'm like, so it's like this weird feeling of like trying to like balance the two things. I don't know working that whereas when I play this on the bass it's like so smooth because I can't do that much with the bass right now so I'm just like oh I just kind of let my voice carry the melody but when I'm on the piano there's like a little more of like um I guess possibilities that have to be balanced but that one's called dream IRL or dreams IRL yeah <laughs> Let's play the bird song. This is for the birds. Originally, it started off different, but then I was like, oh, I'm gonna adapt the first part to be one-handed. It's about a bird that is terrified of flying, but it knows it can fly because it's a bird. 
and it knows it's a bird that can fly. But I might change it because I don't really like the sound of it. I don't know if it ever happens to you, but sometimes when I play music, I'm like in the song, but then all of a sudden something happens and I'm like somewhere else. But I'm like, I know I'm playing a song, but then I'm getting different feelings and emotions from it. That was really weird. I was like, what? 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 Hmm. Oh, well, to be processed later. Um, <laughs> I'm going to take a sip of water. <laughs> Intermission.
I realized I could have just paused the recording, but like, whatever. Um, uh, that was just a weird thing. Okay. Um, how did we get here? <laughs> I know. which is kind of sad, but only for now, so, yeah. Okay. This is very interesting. Should we go with it? Fuck it, let's go with it. Okay. But let's turn it down because it is a little bit loud. gonna attempt with this one <laughs> tell me how you feel when you look at me tell me how it's gonna grow out of this one cause I'm running running out of time with you so can you tell me tell me how we're gonna grow tell me what's the move tell me how we gonna grow throwing me off. Can you tell me how we're gonna try. We're gonna keep we're gonna keep pushing this. Okay. <laughs> it's like it's it's like making it wanna be like okay, whatever, okay. <laughs> so can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna go. Oh can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna Don't walk away, tell me what we're gonna do Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna groove This is very bizarre Okay, I'm not feeling that I was like, mm, that was very, no That's, that's not the move, that's not the move Um, okay, let's try this <laughs> So can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna groove. Oh, can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna Don't walk away, tell me what we're gonna do. Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna groove. Oh, can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna How we gonna groove. needs we both have dreams and everything in between i've been here so many times before have you been to but i'm wondering if you ever gotten the chance big raccoon to line your heart with your mind So can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna groove. Oh, can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move, tell me how 
we gonna hurt? Don't walk away, tell me what we're gonna do. Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna groove. Okay, you tell me what we're gonna do. Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna hurt, how we gonna groove. So can you tell me what we're gonna do? <laughs> tell me what's the move. And the last thing. Oh, because when I press that, it resets everything. That's not cool. So can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move. Tell me how we gonna groove. Oh, can you tell me what we're gonna do? Tell me what's the move. Tell me how we gonna don't walk away, tell me what we're gonna do. Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gon' groove. Okay, tell me what we're gonna do. Tell me what's the move, tell me how we gonna, how we're gonna groove. Can you tell me, oh my god, can you tell me how? Can you tell me, tell me how we gon' groove? Can you tell me, can you tell me how? Can you tell me, tell me how we're gonna groove? Can you tell me? Can you tell me how? Can you tell me? Tell me how we gon' groove. Can you tell me? Can you tell me how we're gonna groove? Tell me how we're gonna groove. Have you ever gotten the chance? your heart with your mind. That, rac that raccoon was like, hi! And I was like, ah! <laughs> Hello, friend. Okay. Very interesting. So this is very fun. This will be very interesting to watch later. Just my like, just, just me literally just, I don't know what's happening. Let's just see what happens. Okay. Um... <laughs> guitar song so let's see if we can mimic the guitar <laughs> i feel like all the weird like guitars sounds though sound like super weird like this is like this is supposed to be nylon guitar what does that like i guess it sounds like it but it sounds like goofy like this is this is very goofy oh yeah That doesn't sound like it.
<laughs> I had it. <laughs> After all this, and I don't even know what key I'm singing. Okay. Mm -hmm. I gotta slow down because I'm going way too fast. I gotta slow down. Because life's a race and I'm gonna finish. Gotta slow down, I'm moving way too, I'm moving way too fast. Um, oh, wind in my hair always feels so nice if I don't have to go nowhere. And if I behave and act like the rest, will I succeed? Will I just crash and burn? Oh, I gotta slow down. Yeah, I'm moving too fast, so I gotta slow down. Oh, I gotta slow down. Yeah, I'm moving too fast, so I gotta slow down. Cause I so race and I'm gonna finish that. I gotta slow down, I'm moving way too, I'm moving way too fast. So I decided to sit and walk for a while. Yeah, I found a long trail, maybe I'll try it out tomorrow. Yeah, I gotta slow down figure out where I'm gonna go oh I gotta slow down to figure out where I am oh I gotta slow down yeah I'm moving too fast so I gotta slow down oh I gotta slow down yeah I'm moving too fast so I gotta slow down cause I to race and I'm gonna finish that I gotta slow down, I'm moving way too, ooh, I'm moving way too fast. Yeah, I don't even know what chord this is.
I was like, it's confusing on the piano. I was like, oh, what can I do? I was like, I'm always like, more, less, more, less. What is this weird pattern I'm playing? I was like, mm. okay, that was slow down. No, sorry, that's finish last. Yeah, the first title was slow down, but I was like, eh, let's, I want the, the main reason, the main like thing of the song is like to finish last, which I think is funny. So, yeah. Because, you, you know, you want to live like, you know, like, why are we always rushing to live life? It's like, no, I want to finish. I want to live long. <laughs> I'm just going to enjoy my life. That's the main, main, main vibe of that song. Okay. Um, so that was interesting. Um, I'm avoiding this song right now because we're just not at that level of, like, love to sing it. rainbows and shiny things and woo and like pow, 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 pow. <laughs> you know everyone has a song like that time <laughs> I know I'm gonna change 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 it cuz I'm changing change change in my mind I'm changing change change in my mind I'm changing change change in my mind I'm changing my mind changing my mind changing my mind oh changing my mind Bridge is like super goofy and I played it like once on piano and I was like that's the take and then I was like I don't know what the fuck I played so <laughs> it's like just really campy it just goes I've done so many things in my life bum 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 and I have no regrets at all I'm gonna change my mind and there's like a big drum thing 
and then we go, cause I'm changing, changing, changing my mind, I'm changing, changing, changing my mind, I'm changing, changing, changing my mind, I'm changing my mind, changing my mind, changing my mind, oh, changing my mind, yeah, changing my, changing It's called changing my mind. <laughs> that one we're gonna have to really work on to figure out how we we're gonna we're gonna we'll have backup tracks for that one definitely. So many things to learn. I don't know. I do what I'm doing. It's so exciting. I love this. I love this time where I just create from a place of. Actually, you know, I have built up some knowledge. Like, not I am clearly learning from what I've done before. But yeah, it's it's just fun. It's fun. It's fun and it's weird. Okay, let's pick a thing and let's. Ooh, ooh, oh, oh, oh. sad song. Thank you. 
interesting I don't know what that song was okay <laughs> um, mm, I don't know what that was okay <laughs> <laughs> ah okay <laughs> sorry I, just <laughs> I miss my bass guys I know I know I was like I miss it so much <laughs> okay this is good just like Whatever comes out. Woo, 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 woo. Okay. Um, oh. Ooh. I just cracked my back. That feels good. Okay. Might have to take a break now because I feel um, tightness on my right side. And it's beautiful. And it's lunchtime. And I might go get myself a nice lunch and go for a nice long walk and try to see so many different birds I love watching the birds so fun and little animals um okay I like this on the bass but let's see what we can come up with here <laughs> excuse me okay how do you know? Doesn't that sound like something else, though? How do you know? How do you know how I feel when you bum 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 bum? That must be something. Thank you. 
try to figure out if the turn I made was right all along and why did I wait so fucking long have I waited too long have I waited have I waited have I waited too too long cause now I'm here have I waited too waited too waited too long have I waited too long cause now I'm here waiting have I waited waited too waited too long have I waited 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 too long Stuck here in my own waiting room, trying on all the clothes that I thought were new, but I'm still here figuring it out. But have I waited, waited, have I waited? too long have i waited waited have i waited have i waited too have i waited too long have i waited 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 too And then the other one was... That's like such a weird... Pinky exercises, guys. Yeah, I wanna, I gotta strengthen my pinky on my left hand.
that's it. <laughs> I know. Okay.